Leg Mark in the show. And uh, first show, first time working the silhouette, but uh, no stranger with this theater. Uh, I love working here, especially with Spotlight and Firehouse. So, very familiar with this. Thank you, Silhouette. I'm Joanna Jaquith. I'm the director and one of the co founders of Silhouette Theater. And um, I was one in Baby Dance and um, also in Chick the Things. So, all of the shows. <laughs> <laughs> Jeez. Sorry. Uh, I'm Amy, and I'm the assistant director and stage manager. My first one's the one. So if anyone has questions, we can jump into those initially, or actors can share a little bit about the process. Or... Where'd you get the condom machine? We were actually really lucky. Our, um, our set designer and builder had a tampon machine on hold. <laughs>
four of us all kind of working together, even though not all of us are on stage at the same time. I mean, uh, just the communication and the uh, uh, connections that we all had eventually as rehearsals went on and then finally to opening night, just, you know, everything just kind of clicked really evenly. I mean, we never had like, any crazy issues. We all just kind of worked together to get, you know, the show like, you know, breathing and living. And um, kind of going off more of what you said, um, a big difference for me working on this show was, I think, in the literal, you know, telling of it, because it's one of those shows that takes place all in one evening. You see a whole bunch of different theater shows that um, the, the storyline is, you know, scene one's here, and then, you know, two days later, it's, you know, we're at scene three, and then, like, maybe a month later, it's, like, scene five. This is all one night, and it's rare I don't see too many theatrical shows, um, storylines like that. You know, you see those in movies, usually. So, um, it's one thing I loved about the writing right away, is it's all one night, and you can fit so many, like, crazy lines of exposition and weird incidents, and, uh, you know, great, funny lines of dialogue, good mo moments of, uh, make it tear up, too, at moments, and, uh, um, just love the writing on this one. I think another interesting thing about Deirdre's work is that, um, she kind of, the scenes kind of happen around the action of the storyline of, like, the plot, so, you know, we have them all commenting on meeting at the bar, and yet you're seeing the pockets after that effect, like in the bathroom, or, you know, oh, I really like the guy, but it's happening off stage. And like, we had a long conversation with Ryan and Michelle about like, we get that first meet and that chemistry scene, and then the next time we see them on stage together is post coil. Like, there's no other time on stage where they get to actually, as a couple, build that relationship. It's all happening through their conversations with other people. So it's kind of a ballsy way of writing because she's forcing us and, and the actors to really make those leaps backstage to take us as an audience on that journey. And um, that was, I think, a really fun and unique process in, in exploring that and figuring out how we could make those emotional leaps on stage in a believable and, and fresh and realistic way, especially for them, to feel connected to each other. Page long director's note. <laughs> 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 Read the notes. <laughs> no, I think um, I'm I'm getting my math. 